Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Fables Chocobo's Dungeon. I'm your host, the Gamer Darius. I'm just going to start calling it Chocobo's Dungeon from now on because that is a mouthful. So last we left off, uh, Sid and I, I am Choco, by the way, and we're... We were out adventuring, trying to collect this uh, timeless power thing. Say moo. Why, hello there. My name is Marley. I love fish like nobody else. Hmm? No, no, no. I don't like to eat fish. I like to look at them. What kind of cow do you think I am? In any case, if you want to know anything about fish, you see me anytime. I could talk about them all day. I was not expecting the cow to talk to me. I'll be completely honest. Anyways, Sid and I were on the lookout for the timeless power, but that was picked up by some sorceress looking lady first, and a rather interesting looking black chocobo, which I should point out is also voice acted by uh, Travis Willingham, who is yet another voice actor extraordinaire, who is also on the Critical Role crew of D&D players on Twitch. You should check him out. Critical Role is really damn funny. Hello, I'm Mulan. If you have any questions about equipment, don't hesitate to ask. I suppose you're wondering why a cow is an expert on equipment. Well, I've seen many an adventurer pass through the sound and fail. I see all their successes and failures in my dreams, and I've learned from their mistakes. So don't be shy, alright? Ask me anything. That's kinda messed up, Mulan. That's kinda messed up. Melanie. Hello, dear. I'm Melanie. You must be the brave Chocobo. Oh, I do like adventurers. I have an idea. Why don't I tell you all I know about fighting monsters? Yes, yes. Then you'll become a mighty warrior. I like this idea. If you're beaten in a dungeon, you'll lose all your items and gil, which is the currency in Final Fantasy, if you don't know. Except the things you're wearing. Wouldn't that be awful? So whenever you get into trouble, you should skedaddle straight out with teleport wings or the escape command between floors. Good luck, and do be careful. I'd hate to think of my poor little Chocobo dying in a dank, dark dungeon. Well, we ain't playing the darkest dungeon, but you got the feeling it's going to be as... Mm, maybe a little bit harder? I don't know. Again, most of my mystery dungeon experiences uh, is actually from... Knock, knock. It's occupied, Koopa. Dungeon Hero X? Anyways, yeah, most of my experience in the Mystery Dungeon series of games is uh, purely out of Tornico's Dungeon and uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Although I've only seldomly played a little bit of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. It was either this or Pokemon Mystery Dungeon that Rose's Melody was going to have me play. And honestly, I'm more hyped for this at the moment. What is this? Okay, okay. I, I feel like I'm stalling at this point, but let's let's go see what's over here first. Font of the Goddess. That's a neat looking statue. I wish I could get a better angle of it. Alright. Let us leaf. Be like a tree in that fashion. At least they think it's loading. It's a good map, actually. So... Oh, hey. Oh, it's amazing, amazing. The fire has gone from the town. What? Do I know you? My name is Al. I patrol the streets night and day to keep all the town people safe. I think it must be fate that the meteor, da? The dog is talking in a French accent. Welcome to my pharmacy. Except we're closed on the count of the light. The lack of it, that is. I tried to switch the lights on and nothing. Seems like the fire's gone out of this town. What, you guys have a literal fire that lights up the entirety of your town? That's that's kind of weird, to be completely honest. I am Pastor Roche, and my church is up ahead. However, I am praying under the moonlight because none of the lamps in town are working. Oh, gods, give us light. Give us fire. 
You know it's man who discovered fire, right? Just saying. What's up, Sherma? Chocobo! I found my stuff! See? Have you heard, Chocobo? The fire's gone out all across town. It's so weird. I hear voices from the piazza. Let's go see what's going on. Should we hear like, we're like earmuffs or something in this town? I've asked you all here to talk about how the whole town has lost its use of fire. As you can see, we have no street lamps, and we must all eat our food raw. Ew. I know this is a terrible hardship. I can't serve hot coffee to my customers. Please do something, Mayor Gale. I haven't been able to bathe for a week. I want to know what's going on. I do not yet know the cause. But I dreamt a prophecy last night. That the heavens shall send us a savior. A savior? Well, isn't that convenient? It's getting brighter. What could it be? Look! What is that? Oh no! Quickly everyone, take cover! It's coming towards us! Run! Well, at least we seem to get the light part back. Hurry, Chocobo! It looks like something fell out of the sky! An egg? From the sky? Oh, what is it? It's cracking open! Oh! A human? A creepy boy! Great character introduction. Oh no! He's crying! He's adorable! Here? Huh? What? Did he? This is most incredible! He was just born and he's already talking! Raffaello! What? Mayor Gale? Re re remember Oh no, I should not have done such a thing. Why did I have to remember something I had forgotten? Wait, wait! This baby! Did you say it was... Raffaello? He was born just now! How could you remember his name? Uh, you do have a point there, but there is a good reason, I'm sure, that... 
Ah, I'm remembering more and more. This beautiful baby boy is... my name Um are you okay? Look, the baby. Raphael, what in the world is happening? Sudden. Let me check out this egg. Brooch of memories. A brooch, whatever. Strange item that opens like gateway into the whirlpool of memories. Hold down B and Jamel will we'll enter the whirlpool of memories. Chuckbo, is that brooch shiny? I wonder what it is. If we forgot it, we never needed it. But I. Oh, what have I done? Enter. Gotta say, this is probably one of the more weird forms of mystery dungeons I've ever played in. Again, not that that's saying much. I haven't played too many mystery dungeon games. <coughs> then why'd you go into the dark, deep memories? Stupid child. Mayor Gale's Memories, Dungeon of Remembrance. Ah, uh, so what's this thing? Poke it. I can't poke it. No, oh, I seem to keep my level. Awesome. So I can pause by, you know, pausing the game in general. Skip the dungeon, which will leave us. And proceed to the next floor. Seeing as we've not done much so far this dungeon, let's proceed to the next floor. Yeah, but what if you forget where your keys are, man? They're your keys. Poke the frog. Aha! Take that froggy. Rusty saddle. I ain't gonna... I already got a rusty saddle. Oh, cool. Minimap. Okay. Poke. Poke. Oh! Okay, go for an overkill, Chocobo. Why don't you? I wonder if the number of... Wow, these guys are the strongest shade bats. Jesus. Oh no, steam trap. So, I do recall, seem to recall that there are actually jobs that Chocobo can have in this game. Uh, they work much like the Final Fantasy jobs. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope. Now we can go down. They work like the Final Fantasy jobs, Draku. The term is forgive and forget. I mean, wait, no, that's a bad example. Shut up. Eh, woke up. Turn around. Eh, it should be relatively easy. Yeah, okay, you are... Oh, uh, what are you? I remember what you are, I just don't remember what you're called. I think they're like Eremon or Floating Eyes or... Floater Shade, I guess. That also works. Alright, so we turn to this one. Chocobo Cake. What Uh, okay. Ooh, I was really hoping he didn't have, uh... Didn't produce experience points when he had landed there. There's a frog up there. Kind of want to kill it. Ooh, hello. Oh, cool. Recover 20 experience. Or, 
HP. Kinda wish I had saved that for after that fight. I wonder. Okay, I do restore HP when I'm just kicking around in the dungeon. We are not mistaken in our choice. Please, everyone, please follow me. I'm gonna smack this mirror when I recover his memories for him. Of course, he might try to do the same to me for actually recovering his memories. I really need to move a little bit more cautiously, don't I? Oh, I saw you. I saw you. Three, four, choker kick. Ooh, nice crit. Yeah, I kind of do wish that there was a slower setting for walking in this. Oh, this is barred off, isn't it? No? Oh, that's that's indicating that there's a boss on the next floor, isn't there? Okay. I kind of want to get up to level... 3 before I go down there. Mostly out of paranoia. Primarily out of paranoia. Entirely out of paranoia. I might have my chance. Because if the alarm bell does what it does in previous Mystery Dungeon games, it summoned a bunch of monsters. Choker kick! Oh no. Oh no. No, don't. Okay. Whew. Oh, come on. Uh, bastard. I wonder if I can hit that multiple times. Probably not a wise idea. Oh. You woke up before I got to get you. You missed. Alright. Shader bat. Ow. Hell yeah. How far am I to the next level anyways? Or do I even have a next level? I have a next job level. Oh, 46. Uh, I do have the Gashal Greens. I did save those from last time. That was kind of my primary wor worry for a bit. Because it's like, oh crap, that's right. I got hunger to worry about. Something I always forgot about when it came to the previous... Uh, when it came to Tornico. Nice, more job points. Did not mean to hit the alarm trap again, but I don't know if it actually did anything. So let's hope it didn't. Come on. Just a couple of more monsters, that's all. Damn that critical hit rate. Doing good, Choco. Or Boko. Alright, got the SP back. Come on. One more? I need one more for one more level up. Come on, game. Come on. You know you want to give me this one level up. Do I have to sit on the alarm again? I think I gotta sit on the alarm again. I'm alright with it. I just... You know... Abusing the system, man. Kind of wonder if all of these dungeons are going to be just as small as this one is, or if they're going to be like large, sprawling bastards. Oh, hey, I was honestly not expecting frog. Yeah, level up time. Okay. Now I feel a little bit more confident about going down, but let's go ahead and check out this back. Yeah, kick. Ooh, job points. On to the next level. Oh. Is that an anima toys? Okay. Oh, I'm digging this remix of the battle theme. Kind of reminds me of the battle theme from uh, 8, actually. Ow. 
Oh, he does. Okay, I get two moves for every one move that he makes. Ow. Actually, yeah, this is the... Like a remix of the Final Fantasy VIII music. I dig it. I really dig it. Alright. Oh, I do have that potion. Mm, let's sort this shite out first. Nah, not yet. Don't need to use it yet. Don't need to use it all. I'm good. Yeah. Was that a mid-boss? Was it mid-boss? Okay. Was some sort of boss. Ooh, hello. Okay. Giant Shade Turtle blocking off memories to Mayor Gale. We must never forget the day the calamity struck our town. Nor must we ever let the loss of the nine brave souls be in vain. We must carry on and continue to defend our town, our world. Because there is hope, one last glimmer of hope. Please follow me and believe in me. Because the future is only for those who believe. My name is Gale, and I am the mayor of Lost Town. Okay, I'm not afraid to admit that I still get a little bit choked up hearing the prelude to Final Fantasy. Something from long ago, a memory. Anyway, there is one thing that I remember now. My name is Gale, and I am the mayor of this town. <laughs> forgetting is supposed to be a virtue, but I must admit, forgetting who I am is taking it a bit too far. Chocobo, if we take this baby with us, Baby Sid can get his memory back. <laughs> Mayor Gale, I'm taking Raffaello home. Good night. Uh, wait, Sherma! Chocobo, I'll see you back at the house. I mean, shouldn't we hear what the mayor has to say? An egg falls out of the sky and out of a hatches a baby boy. Is this not a dream? Nope. Not a dream. As crazy as it sounds. Oh, I almost forgot. I had the keys to the bank. Uh. I guess he was out here to give the keys back to the bank? I mean, I guess. So you're the bank, right? The mayor just came by to open the bank. I can finally withdraw some cash. That Dardola dude is bugging me to pay his tab at his restaurant. I sure don't want to get get in Meja's bad books. She is one nice waitress. So I guess now I can stock things in here. Not stock things. What's the word I'm looking for? I forgot to open the door to the town's bank and storage. You can use these facilities too, which, by the way, are run by two chocobos. They should be thrilled by your visit. Oh, neat. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that fat chocobos were a thing. 
Uh, so which one are you? Why, hello, Chocobo. I am Blaru, and I'm a fat Chocobo. I can look after any items you're not using. I'm good for now. I do need to sell some of those saddles and whatnot. Hmm, I haven't seen you around before. My name is Noiru, Noiru the fat Chocobo. Money makes the world go round. People change, but money will never let you down. In good times are bad. In times of peace or times of war, the winners are always the ones with the money, money, money. Now then, I suppose you're here to deposit some gil. Uh, yeah, I suppose it's probably a good idea to do so. Oh, no. Cool. Now I just kind of want a place to sell all those saddles and whatnot I found. I don't need, like, five saddles. There's a whole five. Oh, no fortune teller. Are we going to go right down into... Oh, hello. I didn't really see a kid come out from this egg that fell in the sky, did I? should just forget it. This is all just a bad dream. Yeah, that's it. Forget it all and we can be happy. Ha ha ha. I want to scratch your face off. I might be a little extreme, but hey. Oh, the baby that Shema was looking after? That's my fellow? Hmm. First you, then this strange baby. What's happening to this town? I don't know. Why won't anyone sell or buy anything from me? <sighs> well, I'm gonna see what Sherma has planned. And then, probably see about calling an episode. When you need him, he's there. Whistling a tune, he's there. With eyes gently sparkling behind his mysterious mask. Nobody knows who he is, but everybody knows his name. Da, 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 da. Have no fear, Dungeon Hero X is here! Kupa! Yes, he's the hero of the next generation, Kupa! The ancient hero stands with hush hush. His true identity is a closely guarded secret, Kupa! And the E stands for. Um. Card case. I don't know what's happening in this game, but I love every second of it so far. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. <laughs> when we return, I'm going to see what Sherma is up to. She's going to probably try to push that baby into Sid's face and be all like, Get your memories back! And then I'll be all like, Wait, you need this brooch! But, you know, no one else will understand me besides Sherma because all I'm saying is, Kwe! So thank you all for watching. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.